today to talk to Andrew from Project 86. It's a big project day. It's a big day because the new song Metatropolis yep. is out now, and we are going to play it for you in just a moment. But first, we got to talk to Andrew about Good it. Good morning. Good morning, Andrew. Thanks for having me. It's been a minute, huh? It has it's been. been a We're while. Good, We're excited. So good to see you guys, man. It is I feel like it's been too you. long. It has been. We we were talking off air. I'm getting uh, tips from Andrew since I've had laryngitis for like ever. Uh-huh. On uh, since you know you sing so much and you must go through like how does one keep their voice and if you lose it like how does one get uh, their voice back? It's not easy, uh, especially if it's something where you, you're actually sick. Uh, you know, I'll tell you guys a quick story. Last January, I got uh, COVID, and I lost my voice pretty bad. Oh, While I was sick, I was in, I was in my car, and I don't remember what song was on, but I tried to sing along to it, and my throat actually hurt, like right on my vocal cords, and I couldn't sing or do anything for like two months after that. Oh no! Finally, I I went and saw a voice doctor because, uh. I had been dealing with voice stuff for like two decades and I kind of had been putting off going to see the voice doctor, but finally it was, this situation was bad enough that I needed to go. So I was ready for bad news and I went in and they showed me my vocal cords and she said, no, your voice is perfect. You're great. You just start dealing with residual after being sick. That's it. So you, you should be fine here pretty soon. So it was actually like way better than what I thought it would be. Oh yeah, because uh, you're always afraid I know that, you'd have to have surgery or yeah. you know, just surgery like or not be able to do anything. I won't have a voice anymore. Uh, yeah, and that's every singer's fear, especially if you play heavy music, is that one day you're going to be told that you, you're not allowed to sing that way anymore, or that you don't have a voice at all. So I I got the opposite news, which was amazing, and that was right before we went into the studio to record. Uh, part one of this double album that we're releasing here shortly. Hey. So that's Omni, which is, you've announced it's um, a double album coming out. And so yesterday, Metatropolis, the new single for Project E6 came out and the new music video, which you'll be able to catch at Radio UTV starting today. And then like Hudson mentioned, if you give us a minute, we're going to play the new song for the first time on Radio U once we're done talking with Andrew. Yes. Uh, Andrew, before we talk more new music, I see on the video here that you've got you've got your place a little decked out for Christmas. Are we uh, all ready? <laughs> yeah. What do you got going on special? Any uh, traditions or anything that make uh, make the holidays fun for you? Uh, pretty typical stuff, I guess. You can see the Christmas tree in the background. Uh, I like the know, light show above just, it. <laughs> yeah, that's new. That's new. The family and I picked out uh, a new tree topper, and we went with the. Uh, I don't know what you call that. The projection yeah. topper. Oh, that, yeah. Okay, w- so it's like the little projector I on like the top. That. Yeah, yeah. I had never seen one of those before. I was at, uh, where were we? Target. Yeah. And uh, we're like, oh, this looks pretty cool. So we, we went with that. And, uh, I mean, as far as traditions, I don't know if we have any or I have any that, are too strange or unique. One of the things that we do is we get a new Christmas ornament every year. Uh, We usually do an advent calendar of some sorts. This year we're doing a Lego one, which is pretty cool. Lego. Yeah. That's the popular one. Lego Harry Potter advent calendar, which is really fun. (laughs) Yeah. Uh, We drive around often to look at the lights. The kids love those. Um, We've got some neighborhoods in my area that go pretty crazy. Uh, Other than that, exchanging gifts on on Christmas and doing good food and seeing family. Hey, man, I wish I had something cooler uh, (laughs) to report. It's it's all all it's all pretty pretty standard fare. You're in the same boat as us because we were talking about traditions, you know, during the show the other day. And it was just like, man, we don't, I feel like growing up, none of us did anything too out of the too ordinary. Yeah, yeah, just everything was pretty standard. And I must feel like now I got to come up with something and I have something yeah. that's more exciting of a tradition. But I think we're all in the same boat. It's just going to be a, another good Christmas, but pretty yeah. standard. It's almost here, though. So that's why, you know, I just wanted to find out if you had anything unique. But uh, well, now we I know he has the tree topper projector. I'm going to so. say, I'm going. Going to Target 
on Boxing Day to, to see if that? I can get it on discount. That's <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I haven't seen that before. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is Andrew from Project 86. Again, uh, Metatropolis, the brand new project song, which has been way too long. Uh, we're going to play that in a minute. Um, has it been finished for a while? And like, this is the, the time gearing up to the double album release? Or like, did you just finish this song? Or how long has it been? I think mastering was a couple of months ago. It would have been October that we finished mastering. So I guess a typical amount of time before release. Uh, we're still working on, as of this recording, uh, the part two of the double album. So oh, okay. uh, nice. this is the first single uh, from part one of the double album, Omni. And the album itself drops on streaming. Part one of the double album drops itself on on streaming February fifteenth. So, this is the first piece of music from that, and there'll be more along the way between now and February fifteenth. Nice. I wanted to ask. Uh, I've been observing like a lot of the album art and the videos you've been putting out uh, with it. Are you the one that that does all of that as well? All the design, all the design art. Oh no! Thank God. Yeah. <laughs> no other other people. Other people. Uh, the, but you're so artistic. The guy who's doing <laughs> the guy who's doing the album art this time around is a guy named uh, Donnie Phillips, and uh, he's done so many amazing packages for so many great bands. He's so talented, and uh, I'm really stoked to work with him. Um, yeah, and then as far as the music video goes, because it's kind of like a I don't know hybrid concept, it's animated, live action. There's all kinds yeah. of media in it uh no we've got a team working on that I, i'm involved obviously but uh i don't do any of the heavy lifting on those things i just <laughs> point, point you have to say next point. time andrew, no over andrew, there put over it over there, there. andrew needs to say next time he can do it uh, and he's just you know decided i to can delegate i can delegate. yeah yep. our last our previous album i did the album art and uh it was fun. It was something that I had always wanted to do. But when I was finished with it, I'm like, I don't want to do this again. I want to yeah, hire someone to do that's this. That's a lot of that's work with everything thing. else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. we're so excited. So for Metatropolis, is there anything you want to, do you want people just to hear it and take from it? Or is there anything you want to um, introduce with yeah, it? Set the table for yeah. us. Yeah. So if you don't know the story, which if, if you haven't been really Cl closely following what's been going on with project you probably don't know this so i'll give you some context without revealing too much uh this song in the music video uh is a part of a, a small part of a film that we're working on that will uh well basically what's happening is lp1 or the first part of the double album functions as a score for a larger film that that this music video is the first part of that you'll see. So that's in production right now. And we'll be dropping music videos along the way leading up to the album release. And then we'll drop more music videos after the album release and finally drop this film. There's also a book that goes with it. Uh, all of it ties together. All of it fits together. It's meant to be kind of an immersive experience. Uh, and the story of the album deals with uh, the idea of transhumanism. And uh, at a point, I say about 20 years in the future, mm -hmm. uh, mankind, and, and this is theory, of course, mankind and one tech company in particular who takes over the world uh, develops the ability to uh, cheat death for all humanity and what happens uh, in, in the shadow of that is what the, the album is about. So, and this is one so light, small just light part fair. of a uh, <laughs> <laughs> very light fair, nothing too deep. <laughs> yeah. Like no, nothing too serious. It's yeah. kind of like all, all comedy, lighthearted, <laughs> pretty, pretty goofy. Well, your deep stuff. We're kind always... of going for like a ska thing on this <laughs> release. If we start hearing horns in the rest of the double album, uh, we're going to be surprised. Yeah. Well, are we ready to play yeah, Metatropolis I need to, I need for the to hear this very again. first time on Radio U? Uh, the Omni album, like you mentioned, the first one starts streaming for the double album on February 15th. All right. Well, uh, let's do the new song. Thanks for joining us, Andrew. Can't wait to uh, hear all of the new stuff you got coming. Pleasure's all mine, and thank you guys. Hang tight one second. It's a new Project 86.